Timeless Concepts from Physics Helpline. In this video tutorial, we will discuss a multiple choice question on the tension developed in a rotating rod. The question is as follows. A uniform rod of length L and mass M is rotating about one of its ends with angular velocity omega. The tensions in the rod at distances L by 4 and 3 L by 4 from the axis are T1 and T2 as shown in the figure. Then the ratio T1 by T2 is the options are 7 by 15, 13 by 15, 15 by 13 and 15 by 7. Now for the answer. Let us first determine the tension developed at a distance x from the axis of rotation of the rod. It is given that mass of the rod is equal to m and length is equal to l. Consider an element pq of length dx at a distance x from the axis. Therefore, mass of the element is given by dm is equal to mass per unit length into length of the element which is equal to m by l into dx. Angular velocity is given as omega. Therefore, tension in the rod at a distance x from the axis due to the element is given by dt is equal to mass of element into x into omega square which is equal to m omega square by l into x into dx. Therefore, tension at a distance x due to the rest of the rod is obtained by integrating dt between limits x to l which gives t is equal to m omega square by 2l into l square minus x square. Therefore, tension at a distance l by 4 is obtained by putting x is equal to l by 4 in equation 1 which gives t1 is equal to 15 by 32 m omega square into l. Similarly, tension at a distance 3 l by 4 is obtained by putting x is equal to 3 l by 4 in equation 1 which gives t2 is equal to 7 by 32 m omega square into L. Now, dividing equation 2 by equation 3, we get T1 by T2 is equal to 15 by 7, which is the answer to the question. Therefore, the correct option is D. This completes the answer to the question. Thanks for watching. If the video is helpful, then please like, share and subscribe.